Hello everyone, you are welcome to WP Fisher. Today I am going to show to you how to solve cookies are blocked due to unexpected output. Like this. On this page, you will find uh, two resources on documentation from workface.org and support form. But you won't find out the exit solution for this to solve out. This is my demo site, the website working well, but when you will uh, try to log in on your admin dashboard by this, then the page will show blank. And again, uh, if you want to try to log in to your admin panel by browsing wp-admin, then also the page will be shows blank. Only you will be able to access uh, your login panel by browsing wp-login.php Then you will be uh, able to log into your website by uh, your username or email and password. But the error will be shown on this page. When you will try to log into your website admin panel, then the error will be triggered out and you won't log into your admin panel. To solve this issue, first of all, you have to go to your uh, cPanel, go to File Manager, and open your core file, then go to WP Content. Then try to rename plugins folder name. Again, go to your website and try to log in again. Oh, the euro won't gone. If after rename the plugins folder, the euro won't solved, then again rename themes folder. And again try to log in. The error won't solve anymore. Okay, no problem. Unexpected output means your website has error or warning. You must have to find out the errors or warning. Uh, to find out, you have to uh, go to your cPanel again, then edit wp-config.php file. On this file, just change define WP debug false to true. And then again reload this page. Then the system echo the warning. This website has three warnings. First of all, cannot modify header information. Second one similar, third one also similar. Okay, then go to your hosting. Say panel again and find out wp-load.php then you will see what is space before PSP syntax let's remove this and save the file again and reload it again the error will be gone just see this and try to log in to your website admin dashboard then it will be login as usual there won't be shows any problem. After that, just again go to your uh, WP config.php file and then change it to false and then again rename themes folder. Again, rename plugins folder to your default and then reload this. The problem solved. Okay, log out from this website, visit this website, and try to log in by admin or wp admin 
all those platforms are working well and try to log in you will be successfully logged into your website dashboard thank you for watching this video hope this video will be help you to solve your issue also